Alright, hello everyone, I'm back now and I will cast the Grand Final of My Revenge Cup 3. Uh, this is kind of a last minute stream because apparently there were some problems with uh, the stream that was supposed to uh, cast the tournament. So yeah, I just uh, jumped straight to the Grand Final here and it's gonna be Flyer vs Omnipods vs Royal vs Kronos. Uh, in the prize pot is 100 euro, although I didn't, I don't know if uh, 32 players participated. Um, in that case, uh, the prize money will be paid, otherwise not. But anyways, we will do one warm-up first before we start. Uh, the format of this cup is uh, uh, cup mode um, with finalist mode, point limit 100. The maps that are played on are uh, the last map pack of ESL CPS 13. So be happy, Sida, and uh, what's the last map now again? Bigfoot is the last map. So yeah, three maps in total, and I believe it's five rounds per map. So let's do it. Of course, uh, Omnipods uh, played in my weekly race uh, earlier today, so uh, has been pretty active today. Alright, so I guess uh, we all we are ready now. Good luck, have fun. Grand final of my Revenge Cup 3. Omnipods vs Flyer vs Royal vs Kronos. Uh, Royal and Kronos were in the grand final of the previous uh, my Revenge Cup as well. Um, Spam and Massa were in the final together with them. Uh, they, those two took first and second. Royal took third ahead of Kronos. So yeah, we're gonna see if those players will uh, have a battle once again. We are live into the first round and Omnipods gets a no drift, falls down to fourth place. And it looks like Flyer will take an early lead ahead of Kronos. Royal is at third place, 1300s behind. Omnipods, 3200s behind. This landing here can be a bit scary and Omnipods will clip the wall. Now he's uh, more than one second behind the other players. Let's follow the top instead. Royal has gone up in the lead. Kronos uh, follows him closely at second place. Flyer has dropped down to third place now. 1600s behind Royal and Kronos. Royal stays in front of Kronos, but it's not with much. Here comes the ending. Let's follow Kronos. Can he uh, overtake Royal? Royal with much more speed through the turn. It looks like Royal is gonna take the first round of the grand final. 56.36 by Royal. It's a pretty good time as well. Flyer takes second, Kronos third, Omnipods fourth. So Royal goes up in the lead with 10 points. Flyer with six, Kronos with four, and Omnipods with three points as we go live into the second round. Again, five rounds per, uh, per map, so... We will uh, see uh, the maps more than once before we reach uh, 100 points. Anyways, it looks like Omnipods uh, is off to a better start now. Is at third place. Goes for a wide line, should have more speed. Actually, not really. Stays at fourth place. But that is a good turn by Omnipods. Gets a good line over this long turn to the right as well. But uh, wow, this is such a close round. I have no idea who's gonna take first. Flyer goes up to the lead. But uh, both Royal and Kronos exits with more speed, so catches up. Omnipods falls down to fourth place, entering the last couple of turns. Royal with a good turn as well. Can he take another 10 points? Here comes the last turn. Kronos with more speed. Kronos and Flyer will pass Royal in the end. Omnipods takes fourth place. Amazing round. Uh, yeah, nine, uh, 900s between all four players. Really good stuff. So that means that now Royal and Kronos are tied, 14 points each. Flyer at 3rd with 12, Omnipods at 4th with 6 points. As we go live into the 3rd round now, Omnipods goes up in the lead. Oh, Flyer will clip the wall. And gets a no drift in the uphill as well and is now 1.5 seconds behind. Might be even more in the next checkpoint. Yes, over two seconds behind now. Let's follow Kronos, who has dropped down to third place, uh, 1200s behind Omnipods. Oh, good attack from Royal. 
Should have good speed here as well. Goes a bit too wide though and he will clip the wall. Went a bit too wide. Falls down for third place. Omnipost looking to take first now. Kronos is at second. Goes a bit too wide but couldn't really catch up to Omnipods anyways, who sets a pretty good time, 56.35, Kronos.69, Royal 57.42, Flyer 58.57, and Kronos has now taken over the lead from Royal 20 points, Royal with 18, Omnipods with 16, and Flyer with 15 points. Second to last round now of the first map, ESL Be Happy, made by 5 and 9. The world record is 56 point, uh, no, never mind, it's uh, 55 point. 90 something by poker, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, which is set offline. We have a close pack of players. No early mistakes. Omnipods. Once again, goes a bit wider than the rest of the players. But uh, now he will pass Royal at least. Who uh, drops down to fourth place. Flyer is at first. Kronos at second. Omnipods is at third. Royal will have to try and make a comeback. Won the first round, but after that he's not had any any more uh, first places. And he is better, too far behind here, so he's not going to be able to take first in this round either. But will Flyer do it? He is in the lead, but Kronos attacks. Kronos comes back and Kronos will pass Flyer in the end. Amazing ending from Kronos. Defeats Flyer with 200. Omnipods 0.49. Then Royal uh, a bit further behind. And that is the the end of the first map. So I guess it was only four rounds then, not five. Uh, yeah, so only four rounds, I guess. <laughs> Unless I'm uh, too tired to think. I don't know. I think it was only four rounds. Uh, but yeah, Kronos is at first with 30 points. Royal is at second, I think. Let's see. Yeah, with 21 points tied with Flyer. And then Omnipod's only one point behind at 20. So, still anyone's game, and we are now into the second map, ESL Sida. We will start with one warm up round as usual. Uh, the world record here is by Royal, 1 minute 1400. So, this uh, could be his map. Let's see what the other players have on this map. Uh, Flyer got 0.25, Omnipost 0.28, and Kronos only 0.43. So, this could be a tough map for Kronos. Royal with uh, much faster time. Looks like Omnipos uh, opting to not finish the warm up again. Uh, sometimes that could be a good idea because uh, it could be worth taking the break instead of uh, driving the whole round if uh, you're tired. And Royal now goes through the finish line and we will continue the match. The score right now is that Kronos is in the lead with 30 points, Royal is at second, tied with Flyer with 21 points and Omnipods only one point behind at 20. Luck have fun. And again, point limit is 100. After that though there will be finalist mode. For those who don't know what finalist mode is, uh, it basically means that you have to win one more round to um, to confirm your win, and that can be very hard because uh, you know the other players don't have anything to lose, and uh, you won't get any more points. They will, but we're not there yet. Oh, Flyer will make an early mistake, and is 7,800 behind. Omnipods goes up to an early lead. Royal got a small bump from the border. He's gonna lose some time with that, but builds up nice speed here, catches up to Kronos. Uh, this turn got a very tight hairpin turn coming up now. You can see a lot of mistakes, and we see a mistake from Omnipot. So that allows Kronos and Royal to pass him. Yeah, that hairpin turn to the left is very tricky. And Royal has gone up in the lead now, Kronos with 4 speed. Omnipot goes up to second place. Looks like Royal got this ending figured out. Builds up a lot of speed here over the long stretch as well. Omnipods 1900 behind. Drives over the border. No punish. Royal will take first. 0.56. Omnipods 0.74. Kronos 0.92. And Flyer 1 minute. 1 second. 80 hundreds. Kronos remains in the lead. 34 points. Royal only 3 points behind. Omnipods goes up to third with 26. Flyer now at fourth with 24. 
second round of the second map. It's now begun. Flyer with that early mistake. Let's see if you can avoid it this time. Much better start from Flyer. And the Fox with good speed will pass Royal. This time no bump. And you see Royal landing a bit more to the left than the other players. That allows him to build up more speed over this long stretch here. So that is key to why Royal is so good on this map. He does that turn very well. And he will actually go up to first after a great hairpin turn as well. It looks like Flyer has made another mistake. So he might take another fourth place. Omnipods having a close fight with Royal. Where is Kronos? He's a bit further behind. 1100s. Royal looking to take another first place on the map that he got the world record on. Follow Omnipods. Can he make another turn here in the end? No. Royal will stay in front. 0.55. Another solid time by Royal. 10 hundreds ahead of Omnipods. Um, 30 hundreds ahead of Kronos and then Flyer with another modest time after another mistake. So Royal now in the lead with 41 points. Kronos at second with 38. Omnipods at third with 32. And Flyer at fourth with 27. As we go live into the third round of the second map. And we see a flyer with a very early mistake. Yeah, this is not flyer's map. Though he has a pretty solid time, 0.25, top 4. But uh, so far, he's having major trouble with this map. we we'll try to catch up, 36 hundreds behind. But it's gonna be tough. Let's we'll see the hairpin turn now. We often see some action here. Oh, no mistakes from any of the players. Very close in the top between Kronos, Omnipods and Royal who goes up in the lead. Royal looking to take first for the third time in a row but then goes too close to the wall. Falls down to fourth place. Flyer will pass him. Omnipods now at first. Ahead of Kronos. Big mistake from Royal. Omnipods driving so riskily over that border. 0.57. 0.65 by Kronos and Flyer will take third ahead of Royal. And yeah, Royal uh, not happy with that round. You don't often see a mistake in that turn where Royal crashed, so he knows that was an unnecessary mistake. And now he's tied with Kronos, 44 points each. Omnipods with 42 and Flyer with 31 points. Fourth round now of the second map, and I guess this is the last one. No early mistake from Flyer. He actually goes up to the lead. Let's see it Royal here with his different landing from the other players. Builds up so much more speed. And uh, might be able to pass with Flyer who has dropped down to third. Ooh. Royal with a good turn goes up to second place, but Omnipot still at first. Very close round though. Who's gonna take this one? The ending will decide it. Omnipod still in the lead. Flyer goes too wide. We'll have to go to the right of the pole, but he gets a lot of speed though. Comes back to second place. Can he take first even? No, Omnipod will take first. Flyer takes second. Kronos at third. 100 ahead of Royal. 900 between all four players. Amazing round once again. But with that first place, Omnipods goes up in the lead with 52 points, Kronos with 48, Royal with 47, Flyer with 37. Pretty good final so far. Alright, so here's the third and final map that is used in this tournament. ESL Bigfoot by Kappa. World record is uh, 55.48 by Karian, I do believe. And we will start with one warm up round. This map got a pretty quicky start, especially this turn here. You can see some mistakes. And uh, I would also say that this is uh, the easiest map out of the three, so we might see the closest rounds. And also, let's take a look at the Dedemania. So, uh, Omnipods got the fastest time, 0.59. Flyer, 0.62. 
Royal 0.65 and Kronos is not even in the Diddy. No, never mind, he's there. Top 25 with 0.77. But again, Kronos with uh, not the best time. Of course, that doesn't really matter too much. And he is putting up a good fight here in this final, that second place. But that is the end of the warm up. We are starting. And currently the score is Omnipod in the lead with 52 points, Kronos at 2nd with 48, Royal at 3rd with 47. So let's see if Flyer, Flyer can do a better job on, uh, on this map. So let's follow him here in the first round. As he uh, gets a pretty decent start. Second place, uh, goes up to first place after a very good turn. Royal has dropped down to last place, 2400 behind. Oh, Flyer goes a bit too wide, loses his grip. And he is at fourth place again. Not what he needed. So now Kronos and Omnipot are in the lead, 1800 ahead of Royal. But Royal with good speed, catching up a bit. 1100 behind only, can Royal make a good ending? He's certainly gonna try for it, and he is catching up for every turn. Here comes the last turn, can Royal make it? No, he gets a bump from the border, and Omnipus is gonna take first. 400s ahead of Kronos. 0 0.95, 0 0.99. So Omnipus with another first place, and now got a lead, 0 0.62. So he's 8 points ahead of Kronos, 11 points ahead of Royal. And 22 points ahead of Flyer as we go live into the second round. And we have another close pack. Flyer once again having trouble with that turn. Oh, and he will clip the wall. Flyer is not feeling it right now. So many mistakes. And Royal with a great turn goes up to first place ahead of Omnipods. Kronos is at third, 2200s behind. It's been a while since, since uh, Royal won a round, so he definitely needs this. Still 1600s ahead of Omnipods. This is Royal's round to lose. And he will stay in front of Omnipods. 0.82 is also a decent time by Royal. 0.91 by Omnipods, 56.12 by Kronos and 57.69 by Flyer. So Royal now uh, getting closer to Omnipods but still 7 points behind. Kronos is now at 3rd with 58 and Flyer is at 43. He needs to step it up. Of course finalist mode, anything can happen. So I wouldn't count Flyer out. And where is Kronos? Okay, he's not too far behind. Ooh, small bump from Flyer allows Kronos to pass him. Ooh, Kronos went so close to the wall. Flyer will pass him. I think Kronos had to adjust his speed a bit. And Flyer will pass Kronos here over the long stretch. But let's follow Fly. I mean Royal and Omnipods in the top. They are having another close battle. That's a good turn from Royal. Allows him to get a couple of hundreds, six hundreds out of Omnipods, but Omnipods not out of it yet. Here comes the ending, Omnipods tries to attack, but Royal will stay in front. 0.90, hundreds ahead of Omnipods, Kronos takes another third place and Flyer takes another fourth place. So Royal catching up and is now only three points ahead of, uh, I mean behind Omnipods, who's still in the lead. Kronos at 62 points, Flyer at 46. So we are getting closer to 100 points. And this is uh, looking like a fight between Royal and Omnipods for first. Great start from Kronos. Ooh, Royal almost went too wide. Kronos went too wide. And went to fourth place. 1900s behind. Royal with good speed here, catching up a bit. Flyer is doing good in this round, but it is Omnipods and Royal who again... Oh, what happened to Flyer? Flyer with a no drift. 
I've never seen a no drift in my life in that turn, but it happened to Flyer. Here comes the ending now. Another fight between Royal and Omnipods. Who's gonna win this round? Last turn, and Royal will stay in front with 300s. So close between these two players. Kronos and Flyer, they are not having a good time on this map. Definitely dominated by Royal and Omnipods, and Royal has gone up in the lead now. 81 points. One point ahead of Omnipods. Kronos at third with 66. Flyer at fourth with 49. Did not get many points in this map. So, the next map could be the last one. So we are back to ESL, be happy now. Uh, I would say both Royal and Omnipods uh, did well on this map. First time around, so... Yeah, it's hard to call it. But uh, we will start with a warm-up. Alright, the warm up will end now. Good luck and fun. Might be ridden for the last time. Right now, Royal is in the lead with 81 points. Omnipots one point behind. Chrome is at 30 with 66. Flyer at 40 with 49. 100 points is the point limit. Then, finalist mode will uh, take place. So, two wins by Royal, for example, and he would reach uh, finalist mode. And he just needs to win one more round to secure his uh, victory. Alright, here we go. First round of ESL Be Happy. Good inside line by Royal. Puts him at first. Good speed from Chronos though will overtake Royal. Who is also overtaken by Flyer and Omnipods. So Royal drops down to fourth place, but good speed here. And he is up to second place. Very close round. Not the best landing from Kronos. Flyer doing well in this round. And uh, both Flyer and Royal with great lines through that turn. That gives them a small lead over Kronos and Omnipods. Let's follow Royal now as he tries to catch up to Flyer. And he will overtake Flyer as well. Entering the last couple of turns now. Royal looking to take another first place. Here comes the last turn. No mistakes from Royal, and he is gonna win this round. 56.31, 600 out of Flyer, uh, and then Omnipods 0.41, Chronos 0.95. So all four players under 57 seconds. Royal wins the first round of ESL Be Happy, as he did uh, in the beginning of the final as well. And he is now at 91 points. Another first place from Royal, and he will reach finalist mode. Oh, but he gets a no drift. He gets a no drift, is managed managed to save it. I think he did a new drift actually, uh, which is uh, a technique where you can do a drift even though you get a no drift. Uh, but I'm not sure. Anyways, he is still in this race, 2,500 behind. Oh! Let's not even commentate on that. Chronos now in the lead, 1,400 ahead of Omnipods. Flyer at third, oh, Omnipods with a great turn, oh Kronos will crash, Kronos has crashed, Flyer will pass him, and Omnipods is gonna take first here, so Royal is not gonna reach finalist mode, neither will Omnipods, but they might take over the lead, point 0.42, Flyer 0.59, Kronos 57.03, and then Royal 59.49. Royal is now at 94, Omnipods also at 94, Kronos at 73, Flyer at 61. Alright, so first or second place will give Royal and Omnipods uh, finalist status. So if they take first and second, they will both be finalists. So let's see what will happen. Good 
Good stock from all four players. Kronos, great landing from Kronos. See if he can get a good angle through the turn as well. Yes, he will go up to second place. Royal still in front. If Royal takes first and uh, Omnipos is third or fourth, only Royal will be finalist. But this is so hard to call it. I have no idea who's gonna win this round. Kronos goes up in the first first place. Flyer has dropped down to fourth, but he gets good speed here. Entering the last turn, Royal is still in front of Omnipos. Take up the last turn. Omnipos will pass him with 100. Wow, what a round! 500s between all four players. Amazing round. Omnipus will take first, Royal will take second, and that means both players are finalists. Here we go. Whoever wins this round wins the tournament, the My Revenge Cup 3. First place will win 50 euro, second 30 euro, or, uh, third 20 euro. Of course, Flyer and Kronos, if they take first or second, they will deny Royal or Omnipus the lead. And we do see Omnipus crashing in the start, gets a no drift, and this is now a golden opportunity for Royal, but he needs to defeat. Kronos and Flyer needs to be ahead of Kronos and Flyer and Royal will win the tournament. And he is at first right now but Kronos is there to annoy him. Only 400s behind, Flyer has dropped down a bit so this is now up to Kronos to pass Royal but good turn from Royal. He will get a lead with 900s, good angle here as well from Kronos. Uh, I mean from Royal, so he extends his lead. He is now 1400s ahead. Omnipos has retired. This is it. Royal can win the tournament. Here comes the ending. Royal will win My Revenge Cup Edition 3 GG. Point uh, 29 is a great time by Royal as well. So Royal, Acer Royal, will win the My Revenge Cup 3. Took third last time, now takes first. So. We have decided first place, but of course we will also decide second and third place. Omnipods uh, got a pretty comfortable lead over Kronos. So it's gonna be very hard to take that second place away from Omnipods, but uh, with finalist mode, uh, all you need is a couple of mistakes in a row and uh, that could be uh, all it takes. And we are now back to ESL Sida. So this will be the last map, I do believe. Uh, actually, maybe not, in case Flyer starts to uh, uh, win rounds. We could also see Bigfoot, perhaps. But first, a warm up round before we go live. That's not the right way. Alright, that is the end of the warm-up. Let's continue the final. Royal has won first place, but we will decide second and third place now. Omnipods is finalist. Kronos is at 83 points. Flyer is at 68. So again, Omnipods needs to take first to secure his second place. He will not get any more points. Kronos and Flyer will get points. So let's follow Omnipods. He did pretty good in this uh, on this map, first time around. Him and Royal definitely dominated this map. But uh, both Flyer and Kronos are doing well in the round so far. Ooh, great turn from Flyer. 1700s ahead of Omnipots. Here comes uh, the scary hairpin turn. Ooh, that's a bad turn from Kronos. Alright, so it's up to Flyer now to stay in front of Omnipods to deny him second place. He is uh, 1600s ahead, so this will require a mistake from Flyer. Long stretch, both players with good speed. Here comes the ending. Omnipods is gonna risk it, but instead of getting awarded for it, he gets punished. 
crashes and Flyer will take first. Point 0.66 is a good time as well. So Flyer is showing that he can do well on this map. So both Kronos and Flyer getting closer to Omnipods. We will still have at least two more rounds as the sole finalist. So here's uh, his second chance. All three players off to a good start. Oh, that's a scary line from Omnipods. Drove over the border, but uh, not get punished. And good landing, he goes up to first place. Ahead of Flyer and Kronos. Flyer with a great turn, will actually go up to first place, Kronos also with good speed. Uh, this is gonna be very tough, Omnipods will actually drop down to third place. Both Flyer and Kronos passes him, so important to build up a lot of speed over the long stretch. Omnipods will pass Kronos, but Flyer is still in front and Kronos comes back with more speed and oh! Omnipods falls out of the track, tries to risk it once again. Flyer takes first once again, point 0.50, Kronos point 0.82. This is not gonna be easy for Omnipods. He needs to set a very fast time to defeat Flyer, unless he makes a mistake. So yeah, Omnipods, uh, I mean Kronos now at 93 points, Flyer at 88. Kronos can reach finalist mode now if he takes first. Flyer still needs to... Uh, has at least two more rounds until his uh, finalist as well. Looks like Kronos has fallen down slightly in the start. Ten hundreds behind. This landing here so important and Omnipods with a better landing once again goes up to first place. Here's another crucial turn. So important to build up a lot of speed and looks like Flyer once again is gonna go up to first place ahead of Omnipos and Kronos is also in this round. Alright, here comes Omnipods now. Can he get a good position? Get good speed. Flyer goes through, goes on the right again, has more speed though, passes Omnipods once again. Omnipods with a risky line. Can he take first flyer? Tries for it, but he's not gonna be able to pass Omnipods, and Omnipods will take second place. Four thousands ahead of Flyer. Such a clutch ending. And Omnipos will take second place. Alright, so who's gonna take third place now? Kronos versus Flyer. Both players will reach finalist mode as long as they finish the round. So yeah, this round is uh, not really uh, worth uh, casting. Since uh, basically two players just need to finish. But what happened to Flyer? All of a sudden he's driving really good on this map. Setting really fast times and uh, is now in the fight for third place at least, which uh, I wouldn't have said uh, one map ago. So, definitely a great comeback from Flyer. And looks like Kronos did make a mistake, but again, just needs to finish. And both players will be finalists, so that will uh, mean we have just one more round left to go after this. And I wonder, will we have a map switch, or is there one more round left of this? Uh, no, actually, I think this is the last round of this map, so we will have a map switch. Bigfoot will decide who takes third place, and Flyer was not good on Bigfoot. Although neither was Kronos, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, it's very hard to predict. Definitely key to drive safe, make no mistakes. So we will have of course a warm-up round before the last round will start. Flyer versus Kronos. Flyer does have a good time here, 0.62. 
with Kronos only having point seventy five or seventy seven, I mean. So that means Flyer knows the map a bit better, might know certain details that the Kronos don't know, and that could play an important uh, factor in who's gonna win this. Alright, that's the end of the warm up. Let's do it. Kronos versus Flyer for third place in the My Revenge Cup 3. Royal has already won it ahead of Omnipods. Final round. Slightly better start for Flyer. 500 head of Kronos. But Kronos with good speed. And he will come back neck and neck between the two players. Through the first couple of turns. Oh! Flyer gets a no drift! Flyer with a no drift! And that could be it if Kronos can avoid any more mistakes. He is gonna take third place. Fly with another no drift on this map. Oh, but Kronos hits the pole! Kronos hits the pole, the flyer will pass him! 5900s ahead is now flyer! Oh my god! Flyer is gonna take third place unless another mistake will happen. Wow! <laughs> that was a crazy final round. Flyer is gonna take third place. 56.58. Kronos. Cannot feel good about that. Had third place. And this is again Kronos losing third place. He lost it against Royal in the previous uh, My Revenge Cup. Uh, but yeah, that is it. Flyer will take third place. Royal, though, will take first place and wins uh, 50 euro, I do believe. Omnipods takes second, wins 30 euro, and then Flyer will take third and wins 20 euro. That's it. Congrats to all the winners. Thanks for watching. See ya later.